just come my way wherever I go Hard luck is there to stay Good luck never stays a day A bad luck's always coming my way For tonight's grim adventure, we find ourselves in St. Louis, Missouri, Jessica's hometown. Today we're going to be visiting a place known as Creepy World, one of the scariest, most intense, biggest haunts in the country. It is, after all, known as Creepy World. Right now we're walking the haunted hayride track. Yes, they have a haunted hayride. The night is about to begin. The scare actors are getting in costume and getting their makeup done, and we're taking this opportunity to visit the Psycho House. I can't believe they actually have this built here. This is cool. Now, the haunted hayride that they have here takes you through some of the most memorable, iconic horror movies. And of course, we're gonna come back and show this in full swing at night with all the lights, but you kind of have to walk through and just take it all in. For instance, right here, it's freaking Nightmare on Elm Street. I mean, come on. How freaking cool is this? They even have Freddy Krueger here waiting for unsuspected passerbyers, whatever you want to call them. I'm not gonna lie, baby. You belong in the Elm Street universe. It's the hat. It is the hat. It's the hat, yeah. <laughs> the reason that we're walking through this right now, it's called the magic hour, where everything just kind of pops to the eye and to the camera. It's the perfect time to capture everything. Not and too bright, also, not too dark. we're kind of killing time, no pun intended. I mean, we are, after all, at a haunted attraction. But like I said, all the the scare actors are getting ready. We're gonna show them in a little bit, hopefully. But, ah, oh, you'll see, this is gonna be fun. Remember I told you that this haunted hayride features all the iconic horror films? They even have Jaws. Well, sadly, it looks like the, most of the water is drained. But they do have good old Bruce there. Now you may have noticed that I just called the shark Bruce. Well, if you didn't know this, in the movie Jaws, the name of the mechanical shark, its name was Bruce. Well, here at Creepy World, this is David, Bruce's brother. Well, it's not really David, it's just what we call it. We like to name things in haunts. So this is David. They even have a facade for the Amityville Horror. This place is awesome, baby cool. <laughs> There's even a, a covered bridge here, which could only mean one thing. The legend of Sleepy Hollow. I love this. Oh, and over here, they actually have some horses a pumpkin man, well, the Hessian soldier. I gotta get a closer look at them. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda wish I had a pumpkin head right now. Well, if there's one person here that can make that happen, it's these guys here. And they even have a Camp Crystal Lake here. <laughs> I love this place. I just, we're just doing the hayride right now and I'm already losing my mind. And of course, if you're gonna have Freddy Krueger, you gotta have Jason. <laughs> Thankfully, we're not counselors, so we, we should be safe. I don't know, just be careful. There's no promises, of course, but we should be all right. I love that they have the cabins here. Yeah. This is pretty freaking cool. There's a boo hole right there. Excuse me, sir. Oh, right there. Watch where you step, baby girl. There's a corpse on the floor. Excuse me, ma'am. 
and right after Camp Crystal Lake. Looks like we have it. Baby, this is nuts. Oh, man. It's loud. It is loud, and I'm loving it. Look at this over here. There's one last thing that we want to show to get us into the Halloween spirit. And that is Michael Myers and the Myers house itself. You gotta have it, right? This is how you know it's Halloween. Leave it to Jessica to find some pumpkins. And they got them in abundance here. We're going to show you later on once the sun goes down. But she is happy as a lark when it comes to pumpkins. Well, I should say jack-o'-lanterns. It's polite to introduce yourself. <laughs> now, just a quick heads up. This is opening night and there's a lot of newbies here which is fine but here's the thing everybody's a little nervous it's it's like stage fright right everybody has those beginning of the season haunt jitters so we're kind of giving everybody their space i told them that we're basically just a fly on the wall or flies on the carcass whatever you want to say you can hear chainsaws the fog is starting to come out this is cool i'm a fly <laughs> Now here's the thing that makes Creepy World a little extra creepy. It's not just one house. It's not just one experience. There's like nine or ten different houses here, as well as a haunted hayride, a midway, a zombie paintball. I mean, the list goes on and on. Now, baby girl, when we first got here, we had the opportunity to walk the entire property by ourselves. We're like the only people here. Do you have a favorite spot that you can't wait to see once the night falls that's a little tough because we got lost <laughs> we did a couple get lost. times uh, so i think we skipped sections but there's a section that i know is going to be really full of fog okay i'll tell you when we get there all right all right with the sounds of chainsaws off in the distance it's kind of halloween i'm going to tell them what your favorite was your favorite was Silo X. Oh, was that the name of it? That was the okay. name of it. We, we got lost for a good 10, I would say good 10, 15 minutes. There's an actual minutes. maze inside. Yeah. My personal favorite is where we started this video off at, the intro, which was the Haunted Hayride. The Hayride. And I can't wait to experience it yeah. at night. There's just something to, to me that says this is Halloween. And that's like a hayride? A hayride, right? A scary hayride. Yeah. 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 Oh, so excited. Well, it is officially that time. We got quite a few people lining up for makeup and wardrobe, so let's take a look. representative of St. Lucifer's Hospital, where we do brain experiments and we just performed the first brain surgery on this guy. It was a failure though. So, on tonight for an appointment with Dr. Faust, Dr. Frankenstein, and Dr. Jekyll. You're gonna tell him. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> right now we're just hanging out with all the scare actors getting ready for a night of scares it's like a family the haunt family for life all right baby ghoul i found out what's going on i asked around yeah the getting ready to send the first set of scare actors into the first house, which means 
we're going to have a, a haunt pep talk, if you will. Working closer to the lot. He's going to be in there. I'll just check on Midway and take photos. He's pretty straightforward. Don't touch anyone. I'll freak out if I find out anybody touched anyone. Yeah, no touch. And if somebody does touch you, grabs you, punches you, it doesn't really happen much. At least not in a couple of years. We've been pretty good. Uh, if that does happen, usually we have a security guy up front. You can always run to him or just tell me because I always walk through every like. Are you funeral home or hospital? Both. Oh. Yeah, that's why I said like 15 <laughs> minutes. And you always hear this stupid thing. It's loud. And I got my, my shocking stick. That thing's loud too, so you always hear that. Uh, for people that's going to be in a drop box, you don't have to use them. I would like if you used them though, because they're cool, and they're loud. Somebody will walk by and you're just going, uh, and then you just continue walking. Like, uh, and please don't say like, boo. If I hear you say boo, I'm going to smack you with this thing. <laughs> that's acceptable, honestly. <laughs> no, 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 Papa, go boo! I'm just getting a shot, yeah, you're fine. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and baby goal. In about 10 to 15 minutes, the gates are going to open up and everybody's going to start coming in and lining up in the queue that's behind you. It's a lot of people. Right? Yeah. Opening night. Here we go. Here we go. The moon is out, it's time for my favorite part, pumpkins. for this to come back to St. Louis for Creepy World. I love the facade that they got. It's kind of like you're walking into a carnival fun house. I did not expect that. That just came out of nowhere. All right, there's somebody sitting there. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> you laugh, you're gonna get yours. They got you good. Oh my god. <laughs> They're following us. Oh, it's so quiet. Right? Sometimes the quietness is scarier. There's somebody there. I don't know if that's a real person or not. No, that's totally a person. Has to be. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> I am. 
<laughs> it's hard to tell who's real and who's fake. That's good, that's good. Come on, sweetheart! This is gonna trick you! He's here! Oh. They are everywhere. They're in front of us, they're behind us. <laughs> I am on you. What the freaking heck? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, what's the bad pretty girl? You not like me? Oh, what I like you, sweetheart. You got such vibrant hair. I love the cat scalping. That'll make a beautiful wing. <laughs> oh, my God. You got to stay here with me forever. <laughs> that is so messed up. <laughs> nope. Nope, nope, nope. I need a leg! Oh. Oh, jeez Louise. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> yes. Baby? Oh, it is so freaking dark in here. Oh, you are. Like all the way because I could not see you at all. Next up we have Slaughter and Son's Funeral Home. I feel like we got this entire place to ourselves. But out of them all, this is the one that I was the most excited about after the walkthrough. Oh my gosh. It's definitely a lot creepier with this kind of lighting in this fog. You still back there, baby? I'm still here. This just goes on and on. Oh man, that's, that's, I love it. So this is Camp Crystal Lake. Really? Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> Welcome to camp. Well, thank you, thank you. We got you. special guests that will blow your mind. Yeah? Who's that? Can't tell you, it's a secret. Oh, for the love of Pete. What's wrong, Gabriel? Help me! <laughs> oh, Help me! oh man!
Alright, this is getting a little trippy. No. <laughs> You'll be dead before it's over. Oh, for the love of Pete. We have ourselves a deal. There's somebody under the picnic table. <laughs> oh. <laughs> They are following Jessica. Come on, man. <laughs> so they are ganging up on us. <laughs> Wait, I think we're going the right way. Well, Camp Crystal Lake was quite a trip indeed. They were, they were ganging up on us, baby goal. And next, we have Krampus. A little bit of a Halloween Christmas spirit. And Jessica's over here because it's cold enough that you can actually see your breath. She's trying. You ready, baby? And you know what? Since we're here, might as well get some photos with some, uh, some creepy Christmas characters like Krampus here. And of course, this evil looking snowman, right? Don't, don't lick the snow, it's not a snow cone. And look at that baby goal, you are almost as big as this snowman. Baby goal, this is a creepy Christmas wonderland, that's for sure. I like it. And speaking of, Look at these guys. This is just the facade of the house. Oh, there's a normal looking one right there. Oh man. Jeez Louise. <laughs> oh my God. definitely has a lot of air scares to it. Got a giant gingerbread man there. Whoa, okay. <laughs> He's a murderous gingerbread man. He's a man. murderous gingerbread indeed. Baby. Something about this just does not feel right. Oh, this blues room. Whoa! What on earth? 
There's just something extra creepy about Christmas. It just goes on and on. Oh man, this is nasty. It's a Krampus leading a bunch of kids to a train. Which way do we go? That way? Oh man. <laughs> I like that you get to walk through these tubes. These like little tunnels. Oh, this is amazing. Right? This looks really pretty freaking terrifying. Oh. There's somebody in here with us. Chasing Jessica. <laughs> you all right, baby girl? Whoa! <laughs> oh. That's one thing about this place, they just won't leave you alone. This is pretty crazy, baby. It's like some sort of alien pods. Oh, that's pretty gnarly. That is really, really gnarly. Next up, we're doing Sleepy Hollow 3D. Oh, dang. Oh, no, that's a person. Uh, that's a person? And Jessica's wearing the 3D glasses, but I'm not. Wow. This is pretty trippy, and I'm not even wearing the glasses. <laughs> See, the air scares. Every they single always time. Me. They always, always do. Oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I'm gonna move that head out of the way. Do you see those glasses? Look at you. They're stylish. That's stylish. <laughs> No, go ahead. Okay. That is so effective. Out of all the houses, this is probably the most relaxing of them all. And then they're gonna get you at the end. Oh, it's making me nauseous. Wow. <laughs> Heck it. Somebody's back there. <laughs> oh, that was good. He was waiting. He was waiting. I couldn't tell. This is great. I love the theming. It's really cool. <laughs> Are you dodging the heads? Yeah.
Oh, that's ah! so cool! <laughs> you that the heads in here are delicious, scrumptious to take a huge bite. If you touch my snacks, I will love that! <laughs> <laughs> well, it is an asylum, so things are about to get a little crazy. Hi! Would you like to sign my position, by the way? No, I would not. It's not like you're giving me a soul or possibly last few numbers on the back here. It's incredible. <laughs> Enter an asylum. That was freaky. Oh, <laughs> you're blind. I love it. Right? Just gonna. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> what on earth? <laughs> This is a heck of snow. They're, they're letting them run wild. Having a hard time seeing in here. There's something in the mist, baby girl. Wait, that's not you. This is not good. This is not good. What? No, it's not good. Uh. Baby, we're the only people in this asylum. <laughs> I definitely don't, nope. Ah. <laughs> Please do me! I hate whenever they <laughs> drop us out in these little spots. Don't me! I feel oddly at home. Oh, Safe would you look at this? Psychiatric Hospital Cemetery. Oh, oh god, I can't I can't even see anything. Come on through! I'm coming! Like I meant this one for you. I use this to put you down. <laughs> well gee, thank you. Well it looks like we have the hayride to ourselves. So this should be rather interesting. Baby goal, I love you. Oh. There's no one else here with no no! <laughs> this is supposed to be my playtime! Of course they send in Freddy Krueger. With the OX! It's just us, my friend. <laughs> Next up we got a little bit of Jaws happening. It is a, a heck of a lot cooler looking at nighttime, isn't it? Oh, wow. Man, even the Amityville Horror House is looking beautiful. Of course, we got Camp Crystal Lake. Stupid Chad, now, now there's some freaking dude in a stupid hockey mask after me, and I don't know why, and he just <laughs> keeps walking at one. I, I think he's behind you. Behind me? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, tell the police. Tell the police. That's intense. He just dragged him off. And he, baby, he's coming back. He's. Oh 
my freaking word, this is cool. This is cool. And of course, we're back to it. <laughs> That's disturbing. It's always good seeing the Psycho House. This is a heck of a lot, a heck of a lot cooler at night, isn't it? I, mean, I love the daytime walkthrough, but seeing it in its element, man, you okay over there? <laughs> I love it. Happy Halloween. They're all here. You got a little dance? We're over here in the huddle circle. It's the end of the night monster fun. Thank you all. You all were amazing. We love you. Happy <laughs> Halloween. Happy Halloween season. Yeah! I love the end of the night shenanigans. <laughs> Thank you for joining us on another grim adventure, this time from Creepy World. Happy Halloween. Wherever I come, I've had luck. It's coming my way. Wherever I go, hard luck. Is that it stays? Good luck never stays a day. A bad luck's always.